Hey guys, welcome back to another video today, and the Javelin has just officially become limited. So now you can actually trade it away, or you can trade for it, and in today's video, I'm going to be going over my thoughts about the trading value for the Javelin. I'll be going over the vehicles you should avoid because they're low value, and I'll be going over the vehicles you know that are high value that you should probably target for. Anyway, before I jump right into the video, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe, it really helps me a lot. Anyway, let's go ahead and talk about the Javelin value. So yeah, people have been grinding really really hard for this vehicle like i saw jailbreak have like 32,000 people this weekend and we haven't seen those numbers since the summer so yeah a lot of people were trying to get the javelin what i currently think the javelin value will be is that it will go up over time i think it's actually going to have some really high value and its value would only be going up so now that the Javelin is officially tradable, there are many types of people that would want to trade for it. So for example, there's some people that want to stock up on vehicles when people don't really know the clear value of it yet. They probably want a bargain from you. And there's also some people that just don't have enough money to buy it and they would like to trade for it. So you would definitely not want to trade it away for low value vehicles like the Airtel or Agent or even the M12 plus ads. People may try to convince you that you should try to trade it for some vehicle that is low value. So, should you trade the Javelin right now? Well, my recommendation is that if you have multiple Javelins, well, then go ahead. And you might be wondering, wait, how do you get multiple Javelins? Well, it's very possible. You guys know that trading was disabled the first 48 hours, right? Well, that's because, you know, Asimo wanted to prevent alts, you know, from actually being able to get the Javelin. Most people would have just had more money in their account, maybe like 5 million, and they bought the Javelin maybe one time, and then they traded it to their alt account, right? But, you know, since trading was disabled, you weren't allowed to do that. However, if you had an alt account with $929,000, well, then you could have bought the Javelin and then, hey, you have a second one. So if you have more than one, then I think it's a really good idea to trade it away. So what should you trade it away for? Well, I probably recommend trying to ask for at least a Brulee. But first of all, let me go over the vehicles that you should avoid getting. These vehicles are cars that are becoming low value. So let me go over them. So the first one is actually the Macron. This is a seasonal car, but it somehow has low value and less people want it. And the second one is also the block seat. This is also a seasonal car with pretty low value. The third one is the Jackrabbit, and this is because just very few people want this, unfortunately. And the fourth one is actually the M12 Bolton. I'm starting to see the M12 actually dip in value. It's somehow just not valuable before. It was valuable like before, but not now. Somehow dropped recently. And lastly, you should avoid getting level one or level two hyperchrome because those are actually, you need to give at least a million dollar vehicle for it. So it's actually somewhat worth that much, but no, people, it's really low value now. So yeah, I would not trade for any of the items that I just mentioned. On the other hand, flying vehicles that has actually gone up in value a lot, especially the Celsius. I've seen that gone up. So if you actually want to trade for the Celsius, maybe you should try for that. Anyway, if you want to trade up for value, like high value, I would try to try to get a Bruli, as I just said earlier, or a Blight plus ads. And if you're lucky, try to see if you can trade for a Torpedo. Now, of course, the Javelin is actually the Koenigsegg Jesko. So yeah, the, the Torpedo is obviously a Koenigsegg. So maybe try to get it. I mean, I think you'll be really lucky if you get it i think it's really unlikely but maybe try and also maybe try for beam hybrid although i think it's unlikely but you can still try to you know trade for it anyway my prediction is of course a few weeks later from now i think the value of the javelin may stabilize and people in you know who generally just trade and stuff will know what the value will be but right now of course it's unclear because the javelin has just became limited so if you can wait to trade for the javelin i would recommend doing that an example of this is the fitter spinner rims when the trading just came out the fidget spinner rims you know, people didn't know that it was actually a valuable item so i saw it getting traded away for like the agent or something so people didn't know they're trading away a valuable item for something they didn't know the value of so my recommendation of course is to hold on to the javelin because you know like the people should have held on to their fidget spinner rims but they did not Anyway, hopefully you found this video helpful about what the value of the Javelin might be and what you should try to get for. Hopefully that helped you out of that. Anyway, if you have any comments or any stuff that you'd like to add, let me know down below in the comment section. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys all later. Bye!